I'm looking for Anthusa. Is she here? Wouldn't I like to know? Sunrise, sunset, I save my drachmi for the taste of the divine. The Terra are hard to come by. So you haven't seen them? Not with the Monger's army on the loose. The Terra won't tolerate that. I haven't done something wrong, have I? I swear I haven't. If you have, you might see me later. I'm looking for Anthusa. Phew. Uh, you know her? No one really knows Anthusa. And Hetera got pushed out of here ages ago. Pushed out? So someone didn't want them here. We don't like to say his name in case his men over here. Just know that Hetera were forced to move out of Corinth's markets. Can you tell me where they've gone? I haven't seen them since. I swear it. I can't afford to pay him. Then I'll keep looking. Someone around here's gotta know. Till then, I'll be on my best behavior, Miss Dios. Are you Anthusa? Me? Anthusa? I could be anyone for you, Lam. I charge less than the Etera. But do I ever know my way around a hay bed? So her name means something to you? Anthusa? She's been around forever, but I never met her. I know the Etera all work as one, on equal footing. But Anthusa's special. She talks, they listen. I haven't met any Etera yet. The unbeliever you hear, they sell what a lot of us sell in Corinth. But for them, it's not just about the flesh. They're merchants, of a sort, streetwise. Can talk as nice as they look. Sounds like a good trade to work in. You don't want to be an Etera? Not in my prime anymore, am I, Miss Dios? By the time I study what they did, I'll be serving clients on my deathbed. If the Hetera aren't here, where are they? Their swords are too high and mighty to be down here in the dirt with us. You want them, you'll find them up on the hill, the Acrocorinth. By the temple, keeping Aphrodite's worshippers satisfied. A temple on top of the Acrocorinth. That's what I'm looking for. <sighs> Who do they think they are? I need to stop them. Yeah! 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 Yeah!
Why were they looking for the Etera? Uh, yeah! They think this temple is dedicated to them, the brutes. Uh, the thieves are here, and the Etera aren't. The Etera? <laughs> They're much wiser than we are. They realized their visitors were all getting robbed on the way in. There's no avoiding the mongers' men in Corinth. I'll keep my guard up. He craves money, Mistyos. Not only that, but power. Once he smells it on you, you're a gunner. So the monger is a Corinthian criminal? Master of the underground markets. He rules with one hand open for money, and the other clenched around a weapon. A drachmi and blood-hungry monsters what he is. So he's hunting the Hetera? Huh? For money? Exactly. Since the Hetera bring in so much drachmi, he wants everything they control. The thieves are better off robbing them than us! If you know of the Hetera, then you know of Anthusa. I'm looking for her. They say she's... everywhere. Though I've never seen her. But the Edera see everything. I've seen them gather by the spring of Pireni, down the mountain. They meet clients there and then take them elsewhere in secret. Good. Maybe pray to Aphrodite from home next time. they'll give for that sum. Ah, so Alexios has finally found us. You know me. And you know her. This is Anthusa. We saw you help the worshippers at the temple of Aphrodite. You've proven yourself a friend. Hear that, Icarus? Her sight's as good as yours. Someone also spoke very highly of you. Surprise! Phoebe! Aspasia sent me. I work for her now, remember? But why here? Corinth isn't safe. I had to tell Antusa you were coming. Aspasia taught me a new word, emissari. That's me. And now Alexios and I have met. See? This is easy. And now I can help you. I guess that'll be alright. Who knows what I'll get into. Yes! Just make sure you're extra careful. We need to move inside, Alexios. We're not the only ones watching. Come with me, and we'll talk. Can I come? As long as you're quiet. To what do I owe your visit? Alcibiades told me about you. <laughs> Did he? Go on. I'm looking for a woman from Sparta. A runaway, long ago. She may have gone by the name of Mirini. Who's that? She's my mother. Your mother? You don't have a mother. Marcos told me he raised you. What did I tell you about talking? I see. There will be time to respond to your question, but that time isn't now. As long as you tell me what you know, sooner or later. You'll have to trust me. You don't get to where I stand without credibility. My word is yours. And you can always trust Alexios. Why don't you go play, Phoebe? Let me and Anthusa talk. If you say so... I propose a trade. Help me. Help us get stronger. Strong enough to rid Corinth of the monger permanently. 
A simple transaction, I assure you. As long as you deliver what I'm looking for, we won't have a problem. Negotiation always involves some compromise, you know. Compromise I can do, but I won't be cheated. Then we're in business. Now, you've heard of the monger? I heard about him after I killed his men. Seems he's famous in Corinth. For all the wrong reasons. His knife has shed much Corinthian blood, but that's just the way of commerce. The blood between us is bad. Then you've held your ground well. You're not dead. Not yet, anyway. But he's employed enough thugs to amass a small army. Now they're attacking people in the street, us included. He's been killing Hetera. Killing? We're smarter than that. But action must be taken before it goes that far. I'm not the only one who needs help. My girls, Damalis and Irina, are suffering too. More monger trouble. I wouldn't doubt it. Work against their aggressors, and then it will be his turn to suffer. You'll find the Malis here at the spring, but Irina has gone to Bellerophron's garden. I'll see what I can do for them. Good. The monger feeds his thugs. With a drachmi, he makes smuggling. Weapons, mostly, which is all the more lucrative now that he has a war to supply. So, if someone interrupts the monger's supply, his men go hungry. Exactly. Go to his warehouse in the port of Lecheo and burn his cargo, all of it. We'll let Chaos take care of the rest. Why rob people who can't put two drachmi together if he has a business? It's illegitimate, but gets him rich. Even the smuggling is a front. He steals slaves, innocents, who shouldn't be harmed, but his thugs can burn. Seems to me that burning his biggest source of income is asking for trouble. I want to put the new muscle I've acquired on show. Plus, violence is the only language he understands. I know many people who speak that language. Then the warehouse will be Cinder's, 